What's up, everyone? I'm Tussle. So we're back to play Red Dead Redemption 2. Okay, gentlemen, listen up, all of you. According to the information so kindly provided to us by the O'Driscolls, the train will be coming north from Big Valley. We're gonna pick it off after it crosses the border into the Grizzlies. There's a raised spot there that should give us good vantage. Charles, you'll keep a lookout for any outriders. How's that hand, by the way? I'll be fine. Good. I'll take the driver and engineer, then run point. Lenny and Javier, you two take the front cars, deal with any guards. Arthur and Micah, you head straight for the back. That's what we're after. Mr. Cornwall's private car. You and me, Morgan. Hey! Have you got a problem with that? Not if you keep your head for once. You worry about yourself, huh? Enough! After Bill blows the tracks, we're gonna need to move fast. Is everyone clear on what they're doing? Yep. Crystal. Yes, boss. Good. Now come on. Let's ride. And the cuts it begin. Why are they, they why are they making like this cutscene? Like look at that. Lighting cuts and something like that. Take like a few minutes for that, you know. gets up here after us oh look at you boys see this is what I call a crew Mike Damn. Bell, Charles Smith Arthur Morgan of you God damn it Mike Bell Charles Smith Arthur Morgan Javier Escuela and what about young Lenny here always the first man on his horse just happy we're back at him, Dutch. You sure you're ready for this, kid? Of course I'm ready. Just stay calm and keep your eyes sharp. That goes for all of you. No mistakes. Not again. So we do this, then we go back to Blackwater to collect. How many times are you gonna ask the same question, Micah? That's a lot of damn money to leave sitting for too long. Oh, shit. It would be crazy to go back there now. The place will be swarming with Pinkertons. We go Pinkertons. back. When I say we go Watch back. Out. Ah, no. Where are you? There's a water tower. Hold up here on the ridge. Whoa. Whoa. Is Bill there? Yeah. You want to head down? See how he's getting on? Okay. Sure. Sure. Hey, boo. What's up? How you getting on? Yeah. yeah. I'm okay. You sure? Yeah. Of course. Can I help a little? Yeah. All right. Go ahead and set up the detonator by those rocks over there. Okay, sure. Now just unspool the wire and then attach Spool. it to said detonator. Okay, this is good. Only one? I thought that was gonna be two. You head back up to the others. I got it from here. Okay.
What's going on? He says all fine. We'll soon find out. Everything okay? I think so. Okay, cover your faces. Trans... Be what? here in a minute now. My phone cover. Oh. This game is kind of beautiful. It's been three years, you know. Gentlemen, Seriously, it though. It's time. Yep. <clears throat> Good luck, all of you. You all know what to do. Here we go. Nope. It was fine. It was my fault. Come on! You're pathetic. You know that? Uh. Run! <coughs> run! Run, 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 run! Here we go! Here we go. Woo. Oh. oh shit, job here! Pull me up! Lenny, I'm, I'm gonna save you! Oh, yeah, yeah, oh, yeah. The others will get him. No, we need to stop this train. What the hell are you doing? Move. There's another guard up ahead. You want me to take him? Nah, I'll take him, man. That's it, is it? I got these sons of bitches. Kill that bastard. That's far enough. Well, that was close one. I thought I'm gonna die for that there. How are you doing there? Okay. Oh shit, what the hell? Break feet, come on. Big feet. Stop the train. Two, four, nine, train. Look at that. You guys see that? Big circle can't even shoot. If I, it gets smaller and smaller, now I can't shoot for that, you know that? All these bastards must be guarding something. We need the car at the back, right? Yep, keep pushing. You still okay? I think so. Good. Damn, ah. Who is this guy? Doing good, kid. Shoot him. Shoot him. Where the hell are the others? What the hell is it aiming? Never mind. I can see now why the Driscoll's brought so many boys up here for this. Now what? You two all right? Yes, let's get the money and go. We got some fellas holed up in this last car. Ah, shit. What are you boys planning on doing in there? Listen to me. We don't want Just to boom. kill any of you. Yeah, no. Any more of you. <laughs> I give you my word, but trust me, we will. I work for Leviticus Corps. Come on, boys. We got our orders. Okay. You asked for it. We ain't Five, opening this door. Four. Three, two, one. 
Seems our friends have gone deaf. Wake him up, Olivia! Oh shit, this is gonna be bad. Mr. Williamson, give Mr. Morgan and Mr. Smith some dynamite. You two boys go blow that door open. Now, it don't matter too much to us, but you boys in there might want to take a step back. Seems enough. Here we go. Now light the fuse. Unless you got a death wish. Run. Get on up there. Search that train. <laughs> the hell? Look at this place. <laughs> it's like a palace. Well, now I've seen everything. Oh, you two got the safe? I'll search the rest. Oh, yes. Should be easy as cake. <sighs> You're just gonna stand there, kid. Pour me some brandy, will ya? I'm parched. Shut up. Me and Arthur did all the work. You guys yeah, can pause it. I don't have time I'll to wait for that. Jump on that train. He's king. I'll give you that. <clears throat> okay. Let's see if we can get this open. Come on. What's this? Come on. Get in there. There. See? That's how it's done. Shit. Just a pile of papers. Bond? I don't think so. Here. Make yourself useful. At least we all know you can read. Give me those. Railroad contracts, invoices, blah, blah, blah. You got anything? Not really. Sugar imports. Oh shit, what's this? A lot of sugar. Some fancy new boat he's ordered from Europe. Blonde. Find the blonde. Another boat as long as I live. Bond, I said. Nice. Yeah. Thank God. Come on. Let me grab that thing. Blind Blandy. Yeah. What Bond do? They worth anything? Oh, sure. Bearer bonds. I think we can probably sell these pretty easily. Mm -hmm. Well done. Now, would you get rid of all of this? The train? Yeah, get it out of here. What about them? What do you think? I don't know. <laughs> it's up to you. Kill them, leave them here, take them with you on the train. Just make sure they don't send no folk after us. Okay. See you back at camp. When you get back, we'll be moving on. The rest of you, let's ride. I'm not gonna kill all of it. Okay, get on the train, quick. Hold it. You too, pal. Just three. So behave. Come on, move. We won't tell a soul. I swear. Go on. I'm not gonna Come on. run for that. Yep. Wait. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, for Lord's sake, put that book away. 
So, we getting out of this hellhole? We're gonna try. Weather seems stable. And we just robbed the Leviticus Cornwall train. We got money in our pockets. The worst is behind us, gentlemen. So the question uh, is, where now? I know this country a little. I told you, we should set up camp in Horseshoe Overlook near Valentine. We'll be able to hide out there no problem, as long as we keep our noses clean. <laughs> well then, mm -hmm. let's go. Clean noses and everything else. Arthur, you're in that one. Bring Hosea. I know you two like to talk about the good old days and what's gone wrong with old Dutch. <laughs> yeah. Dutch remember that. I do like this room though. Looks cool. Beautiful though. It's like real life, you know. Um, some games, they're not saying it in real life, but sometimes they do, sometimes they're not. Like this game. Oh no, go break. Nah, it doesn't matter. Ah, it doesn't matter, right, guys? I'm not gonna mute that song. It's cool. It's a beautiful song, though. Lenny! Micah, get over here! Yes, boss. You two ride up ahead, make sure there's no surprises. We've had enough of those. Me? With the boy? Just go. Come on, kid. You can buy me a whiskey. Oh, don't trip like that. Yeah. Charles, you and me hold the thing up while you try and put the wheel back on, Arthur. You still strong enough to hold up a wagon? Shut up. I'm just saying. Don't say less. Pick the wheel up. Boom. Bash. Nearly there. There. See? You ain't so useless after all. <laughs> Not quite. Oh, Indians. What do you think? If they wanted trouble, we wouldn't have seen them. Poor bastards. We really screwed them over down here. What? Come on, let's not push our luck. What happened? Well, get in. I'll tell you. Okay. Not too far now. Stay on this trail. We'll follow the river, then cut left inland. Yeah. Oh, sure. Over. Okay. Yes. <clears throat> the Indians in these parts got sold a very raw deal. Uh huh. This is the heartlands we're going to. Good farming and grazing country. They lost it all. Stolen clean away from them, it was. Every blade of grass. <coughs> Killed or herded up to the reservations in the middle of nowhere. And how's that different from anywhere else? Well, maybe it's not. I just heard some of the army out here was particularly uh, unpleasant about it. Mm. Unpleasant? How do you rob and kill people pleasantly? 
We don't. In spite of that, just talk. I fear I was perhaps trying to simplify something more complicated for the benefit of our block-headed driver here. Hey, don't blame it on me. Never forget, this here's a con man, Charles, born and bred. Just because it sounds fancy don't mean he knows a damn thing about what he's talking about. God. So, what happened to your tribe? I don't even know if I have one. At least, not that I can remember. My father was a colored man. He told me he lived with our people for a while. A number of free men did, but... When we were forced to move from our lands, the three of us fled. I was too young to really remember much. My whole life I've been on the run. A couple years later, some soldiers captured my mother. Took her somewhere. We never saw her again. Well, that sucks. He was a very sad man, and the drink had a mean hold on him. <clears throat> Around 13, I just took off on my own. That was about the age we found young Arthur here. Maybe a little older. A wilder delinquent you never did see. But he learned fast. Not as fast as Marston, apparently. Wait, I don't understand. What's the problem between you two? Arthur? Yeah, it's a long story. Yeah. <clears throat> we still heading the right way? That depends. Wait, wait. Are we still heading west in search of fortune and repose in virgin forests as we plan? No. Are we heading in the correct direction on our desperate escape from the law eastwards down the mountains? Yes, I believe so. You know this area? A little. I've been through a couple of times. There's a livestock town not too far from here called Valentine. Cowboys, outlaws, working girls, our kind of place. Driscoll's? Probably them too. Pinkertons? Let's hope not. And this place we're going. Wait, but what's it called again? Horseshoe Overlook. It's a good place to lie low. It'll do for now. And how low do you think Dutch is really going to lie? <laughs> it's just, you know, maybe it's me who's changed, not him, but. We kept telling him that ferry job didn't feel right. You and me had a real lead in Blackwater that could have worked out. Maybe. It just isn't like Dutch to lose his head like that. Things go wrong sometimes. People die. It's the way it is. Always has been. Me, you, Dutch. We've all been in this line of work a long time. And we're still here, so... Well, I figure we must have got it right a hell of a lot more than we got it wrong. What the hell you going on there? What are you working on there, anyway? Just some yarrow and ginseng. Good for the health. Mm -hmm. Better than that stuff you buy in the store. Yeah, you can have all this. I'm at the point where I can do it with my eyes closed. Oh, okay. Thank you. Cool. Yeah. <clears throat> Let's go too fast. Woo! Plan can be found to out the wall, pick them under, blah blah blah. Yeah, yeah, I already knew that. There you are, brother. Head in there, follow the track for a bit. Okay. Thanks. Hey, slow up. I'll jump on. Jump in. Hop in. Have you? Okay, let's go. Any trouble getting in here, Javier? Nope. Went well. This is a good spot. Excellent. I think this will work for us, Arthur. For now, anyway. Here we are, gentlemen. Home sweet home. Place is perfect. Are. Yep. I hope so. Gentlemen, we have survived. For now. Now it is time to prosper. Arthur and I were about to prosper in Blackwater. We were onto something big. Then Micah got you all excited about that ferry, and here we are. 
We have all made mistakes over the years, Jose. Every last one of us. But I kept us together. Kept us alive. Kept the nooses off our neck. I guess I'm just worried. I ain't got that long, Dutch. I, I want folks safe before I go. Me too. And now we are stuck east of the Grizzlies and out of money and a long way from our dream of virgin land in the West. I know, my brother, but we are safe. We make a bit of money here, then we move again, head out around them, be west of Uncle Sam, in a few months, buy some land. I hope so. Would you just look around you? This world has its consolations. <laughs> Gentlemen, I'm going to head into the local town and, uh, you know, see if I can strike up a little business. Of course, Herr Strauss. I prefer robbing banks to usury. Seems more dignified somehow. Mm -hmm. Now, everyone, put your tools down for a moment. Come on, gather around. Quickly now. I know that things have been tough. But we are safe now, and we are far too poor. So it is time <laughs> Luck for me. everyone to get to work. Get to work, but stay out of trouble. Remember, we are itinerant workers. Laid off when they shut down our factory to the north. Now get out there and see what you can find. Uncle, Reverend Swanson, no more passengers. <laughs> <laughs> it is time for everyone to earn their keep. There is a town a little way down the track named of Valentine. Livestock town, all mud and morons, if I remember right. That seems a decent place to start. And, uh, we need food. Real food. That means every day. One of you. And remember, mm -hmm. whatever it is that you find, the camp gets its slice. Now be sensible out there. Now the girls have your tent ready, Mr. Morgan. Come with me. You two will be ready shortly. We put you over here. I'm sure everything will be fine, Miss Grimshaw. It should be. Most of your stuff from Blackwater got saved. Everything apart from my money. Oh, don't remind me. Well, we can always make more money. We're gonna have to. Mm -hmm. Miss Jackson, I've seen shit with more common sense than you. Do it properly. Huh, you can't do that on the shoe? That's cool. Well, you know, money is kind of important for life, you know, to survive, so like that. Chapter 2, oh shoot, overlook. The handwriting, I don't really understand, but now I see the text, I do understand for that, you know. A couple of weeks later. A couple of weeks, okay, like two weeks, three. <clears throat> That's a long, long week. Right the mountain, road east into some... Pretty enough country called the Heartland. Kind of beautiful. Far east in many a year. Dutch seems a little better. Mm -hmm. His eyes are sparkling once more, and I can see he's thinking a little clearer. I think we all feel a little happier, in spite of Blackwater and that whole mess. Ah, uh, Blackwater. I think. Jose. <laughs> Quite a day. Let's hope so. There's a bunch of the boys already in Valentine. Bill, Charles, and Javier. And Swanson found something down at the train station by the lake, apparently. And Strauss came back with that creepy little smile on his face. I'm sure there's a whole list of unfortunates he's forced money upon. <laughs> Thank you. And you? I'm gonna read a book. <laughs> sure. Camera. The old star camera. Then. Older than four, you know. Shaving kit. Ah, screw it. I'm gonna shave anyway. Green. Shot chin, mustache. Nah, no thanks. The action revolt. Oh yeah, sometimes when I play on GTA Online, when I get some like um revolt from Red Dead Redemption 2, when I got there and I get that gun on 
um like double action reward from gta online so i can play like um get this gun in this game that's kind of cool though you know this who's this who's this woman who's that pit rust smoking spring rocks wait is that his wife so 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 i'm gonna donate how much money 41 dollar okay i'm gonna donate like 10 dollar in money Okay, so anyway guys, this is gonna be a short video, but kind of a short, little bit short video. So, nothing to say here, but it's fun to play in this game. It's feel fun. I do love graphics, do love some gameplay though. Makes me feel like play. I want to play this game forever, but not online. When I play online, it feels like kind of bored a little bit. Gameplay, boring gameplay for some reason. So when I play this on Sterling, it's really perfect for me, you know. I do enjoy it. So, nothing to say here, but thank you guys for watching and see you guys next time. Bye-bye.